Hey, what's going on YouTube? BDK721 coming at you in front of the camera this time. Uh, I did get a package today, or actually it was, I think it was dropped off yesterday in my, in my uh, mailbox. I just didn't get a chance to go down and check it. And uh, I was notified earlier this week or maybe late last week that it was coming. Uh, a really good buddy of mine, PSU Jig87, sent me a care package. As you can see on the package, it says open up on cam. So I'm going to do that for him here. Uh, I'm a little bit um, embarrassed because I, I usually don't like accepting care packages from, from people, but when they do come, I am extremely grateful um, because you, you guys really don't have to send me anything. I don't really expect it. Um, but I do like watching other people getting care packages because it's usually a pretty, pretty neat thing. Uh, and there's a lot of surprise and excitement involved in it. So uh, this is one of the few that I've ever gotten, and which is completely fine to me because I don't, I don't expect that from anybody. And um, uh, I'm really, I really don't know what he sent me. I have no clue. It just sort of came out of the blue. So I have one thought, one guess what it might be. And if, and if, if it's what I think it is, Joe, uh, I, I'm, I'm going to be very mad at you, my friend. <laughs> If you if you sent me the one thing I think that you might have sent me, um, but let's open it up together. Check it out. Sent me a nice little note. So it's there's the note right here on the front, um, which is attached. I'll take it off here. It says, "Here's a little PC love for you, Joe PSU Jig 87." I'm sure it's going to be awesome. His little note says, Unfortunately, I had to break up the 2013 Museum Collection Archival Autograph Set that I was putting together, which I, I, I was bummed out that you had to do that, Joe. I, I, um, I'm very sorry you had to do that. I sold quite a few, but I know that this was one I could not sell because it had a good home to go to. Enjoy the card. I couldn't go to a nicer guy. Wow. Thanks, Joe. Really appreciate that. That's awesome. Again, you really didn't have to to do that, there's the tape on the back. I'm going to peel it off here nice and carefully. Um, and I will I'll try to slow roll it for everybody here and see which way it goes. <laughs> oh, this is hilarious. Okay, guys, check this out. That's my boy, Mr. Rain, Tim Rains. Oh my god, that's so funny because I I have on my eBay watch list about I'm gonna say about four or five of these that I'm watching people are selling on there. <laughs> that's so awesome. Thank you so much, Joe. I really appreciate it. This is uh, number thirty out of one ninety nine. This is from the museum um, archival autographs. I guess is that what it's called? yeah archival autographs. As he was in the set. For those of you who don't know, this was my favorite player growing up. And uh, hopefully someday he'll be in the Hall of Fame. He's got plenty of support, and maybe someday he'll get in there. Um, for those of you who don't know his what his abilities were, he was one of the best leadoff guys back in the day in the '80s. And um, only Ricky Henderson was better than him, I think, personally speaking. I, there's not many people that will ever become close to Ricky Henderson, but I think Tim Raines was. The next guy in line, as far as as far as leadoff hitters go, so um, I know Ichiro is probably going to be up there as well. So it's it's a it's a close race in my mind. Um, but in his day, nobody was better other than maybe Ricky. But that's a pretty awesome card. Thank you so much, uh, Joe. I am starting a, a a nice little PC of his autographs. He is in a lot of t of of 2013. He has a lot of 2013 products that are autographs this year. So I'm going to be trying to collect those. And this is a great start. Again, thanks a lot, Joe. Really appreciate it. I will definitely hit you back, my friend. It will be coming soon. Talk to you guys later. Peace.